Okay, welcome to the account solutions. Um, this is part of our series of Excel templates designed to help your business and help you run your operation. Um, today we are looking at a simple point of sale system that can be used um, in shopping malls, restaurants, supermarkets, and other little businesses you may have. So I'll show you a simple demo on how to use this point of sale system powered by Excel application. First of all, when you open this system, you need to um, add up your partners. The partners are the customers, your suppliers, your business associates, um, your staff, administrators, those are your partners. If you already have existing stock items in your list, you also need to bring them in as opening balances. Um, that you can have your stock balances in the database. But so just start by adding new partners. Click on this icon. Just put number one, and I call this person John Peters. Position or select supplier. Address seventeen Yet Road, Port Harcourt. email address then just post I'll go ahead and add on that partner let me add a supplier I'll call it beauty world beauty world phones and gadgets limited position of select supplier Address is Lucky Lagos. All right. Okay. Now let's go ahead now you can have different sales points for example you want to go into the sale of phones tablets and other gadgets and accessories so you can have different departments or sales points in the business for example we may have a um, category called phones we may have um, tablets we may have let's say accessories we may also have phone repairs so the next thing you need to do after adding your partner is to add your sales point. So number one, I'll call this phones and gadgets. I'll post. Number two, phone, or let's say accessories. Post. Number three, um, I have repairs. These are services we want to render. Number four, I have speakers. Number five, I have antivirus. Okay, so we have five sales points or departments in the business. Next thing to do is to add in your product group. By product group, what we mean is, for example, you have different categories of um, companies that produce different products. If we have Nokia and the Nokia series, we have um, Techno and the Techno Techno phones. We have Intel phones also. We have um, Lumia phones. We also have OLG phones and the rest of them. So I'll just group these um, categories into different product lines. The first one. I want to deal on techno phones. Put techno. Second one, I just put um, Lumia. Third one, I have Itel. And the fourth one, I have T and T speakers.
also have quick heal antivirus quick heal i have um Rico products Rico. and i also have and yeah OLG product okay good all right let's just go ahead and bring in our stock items before you bring in the quantity of stock you have you need to set up the product items just come to new product select get your barco scanner and look for the product i have an OLG product with me just scan Product name is OLG Easy 62. Now you can choose to put the cost of the product or leave it empty. Also set the selling price for the product. So let's say we bought this for 4,500 naira. I want to sell for 5,600 naira. Product group we have OLG products. Because I have phones and gadgets post. Done. Then let's move for another product item. I have a speaker with me. I just can. Product name here is um, Mini 2 in 1. 2.1 usb speakers the cost is 3500 i'm selling for 5400 naira the product group tnt speakers door center speakers post now i also have another product item with me i have a wikulani just pick the barcode. Okay. Product name is Lenny2. The cost is 18,500 naira. Selling price is 25,000 naira. Product group Wiko. Product center phones and gadgets. Post. I have an antivirus with me from Quick Hill. Okay, so I'll come back to my product code, my barcode scanner. Just look for the barcode and I will scan. Okay, product name is Quick Heal. Pool. And let's say the cost of the Quick Heal Pool is 1500 selling price is 2700 product group we have quick heal product center we have antivirus we post then we have another product here let's pick this These prices are all assumptions as um, they are not the real prices of the products. Product group, let's techno 
call center, we have phone and gadgets. You have to do the same thing for all the products in your product item. You have to do this for all the products in your product list where you bring in the quantities of items you have. And the last product for today, we have the Nokia Lumia 435. Lumia 435. Once you've got in the list of your products, what you need to do next is to bring in the quantities of items you purchased or items you have. Just go straight to um, points and bring in these um, items one by one. Access points, we have phones and gadgets, transaction, we have purchases, and our partner is YouTube World Phones and Gadgets, just um, put random figures that we are buying from For all this 100 pieces. dashboard and check what we have as you can see after refreshing we have our product balances 92 and the rest of them to Lumia we have nothing for this speaker and this other phone we'll go back to our interface and we'll try to bring in um, let's say from John Peters purchases um, of speakers and that one is purchases Get the speaker, and get the barcode. We are bringing in 100 pieces of this item, and we are paying paying for everything. Paid through through a bank transfer, and the bank we're using is Fidelity Bank. Post. post. Also try to bring in our antivirus. Okay, from John Peters, sales point antivirus transaction is purchases. Bringing in like 200 pieces of this item. So when we refresh, we can see that our product. Um, balances are now showing then you look at the table for total purchases and sales you can see um, an amount of 9.15 million check total payment and receipt value due 9.15 million value paid 5.94 million so you can look to know how much you hold um, your suppliers okay guys this is our quality day on the part one of this video tutorials you can look out for the part two on the final conclusion of this tutorial on our YouTube channel. In the part two, we'll be looking at making sales with this point of sale system and other features available on this system. All right, thank you so much for seeing this video. 
um, we hope the video was useful to you um, to get hold of this template you may have to go to our website and click on our customized page where you can make a request for this template because this particular template is not yet on our free template um, page you can also subscribe to our youtube channel and be among the first to get a uh, new video tutorials if you're interested in our articles you can also go to our website and subscribe to our blog and also be among those that will get the articles to your email box thank you and god bless